Because this technology converges the digital and the physical worlds, it helps us work faster and better. That is just the beginning. A visualization tool is amazing, but it's just one step into becoming a real spatial computer. My family and I moved to Florida four years ago. My wife, Heather, my daughter, Annabelle, my son, Michael, we're all enjoying our life here, experiencing a lot of great Florida adventures. I like to woodwork. I like to work with my hands. I would say woodworking requires precision and accuracy, and so does my job now have that passion for accuracy allows my projects to be successful. At Miller Electric, I'm a project coordinator. I bring the design to construction using computer-aided drafting. We take the design from the engineer into a 3D environment and turn that into a buildable product at our fabrication shop. And we're also able to take it into the 3D world, not only on our computers, but with the Magic Leap 2. Magic Leap 2 is the hardware that allows us to load in Argyle, the software, which then allows us to upload the 3D model and immerse ourselves in a one-to-one -one scale on the job site. I grew up in the construction industry, so, but it was around six or seven years ago when I tried spatial computing that I knew it needed to be on the construction side as well. Argyle leverages the building information models that are already being created for these construction projects. Our mission is to bring construction experts their building information models where they need them most, in the field, in the context of the building. So we are taking them, converting them into an AR-ready format that's really fast loading and lightweight on the job site so that you can compare what hasn't been built yet to what already exists or you can see through the walls and see what was built before it got covered up. Hands down, Magic Leap 2 is the device we recommend to our customers. The processing power of the computer was so much better than what we were using before. We'd been really constrained on other devices in terms of how much model we could render at once. But as soon as we took our app to the Magic Leap 2, it was my same app, but I could see further. Working with two-dimensional drawings is not intuitive. It's historic, we've been doing it for a long time, but it's not the fastest or most intuitive way. It takes a lot of expertise. With building information modeling put into an augmented reality, all levels of expertise are able to get a really good understanding of what's going to be built and how that needs to be done. Okay, yeah, let's go right. to level three first. So we'll go through this door here. Argyle's really great at helping construction teams improve collaboration, not only within their own job, but we've seen people talking to other trades. The electrical folks will talk to the mechanical folks and say, look what we have to do. Can you make sure you give us a little room here? So when we arrive to a new area that we haven't set up yet, we're just looking at our model and picking some points to tie into. Here, I'm gonna pull up an alignment tool. I'm gonna grab an anchor here. Right now I'm looking at the electrical that's coming in. And I can see the hangers and the columns here. Now, if we want to see through the walls, just click them off. Now we can see what's behind. I'm excited to be using this technology. It's really allowed me to walk through this 3D model that we work on so diligently for months on end. The biggest benefits would be the quality control, which is saving time, which is saving rework. Magic Leap 2 and the Argyle software will greatly benefit you in that matter. The construction industry will invest in the tools that save them money, that save them time, and that give them a competitive advantage. I think that Magic Leap 2 is the one to watch. Like, look out, because that clear glass is not to be reckoned with. I can see that their team, like Magic Leap is investing 
into it, and so that means a lot to my customers. The construction industry wastes billions with a B on rework. That's just work that's been put in place and had to be taken out. So it's more for us about getting the word out, letting people know that they don't have to do things the way that they've always done them. That will help them save a lot more than any investment in this kind of technology. Thank you.